Good morning. How is everybody? I'm awake. I'm ready to go. Got my Diamond Art Club here. Uh-huh. This is from last week. All right. Think about it. What came out last week? What would Mindy get? Ha-ha. <laughs> uh, tough, tough, tough question, right? I was just looking at my packing slip here. I never look at the packing slip. But my packing slip has a discount code at the bottom off my next order for returning customers. I've never noticed that. You might want to check that out. <laughs> if you order a Diamond Art Club, see if there's a code on your packing slip. Huh. Go figure. All right, let's open it. What else is there to say? Let's just get into it, right? Still have our pink box with the little snowflakey things on it. Ooh, look at them. Look at them shine and shimmer. And we got directions with pictures and contents and all the good stuff that goes on here. It's high purity. Did you know it? It's high purity. And it's protected. Yay. All right. Huh. All right, let's get into it. What is it? Well, I'm sure you probably know, but I'm sure I'm going to gasp and I'm going to go, <laughs> and I'm sure I'm going to say, can I please stay home <laughs> and just diamond paint? Oh, look at those colors. I'm sure we have a toolkit here somewhere. Come on, toolkit and a sticker. There's our sticker. All right. It's round. I know that. It's round. Look at it. It's got a round toolkit too. It's rounds. I love that it's rounds. I mean, I do squares and I will do squares, but I prefer rounds. They're just quicker for me. A little more relaxing if you ask me. Do you need some wax? You need to diamond paint? You need some wax? Pink wax still works just fine. Everybody's trying different stuff, but pink wax still works. It does. We have a multi-placer here of some description. I don't know. Somebody told me once <laughs> that they were going to do something special every time I said, I don't know. And I didn't realize I said it that much. I guess I do. Blue pen, blue squishy, bags, and tray. There's your round tool kit. The difference is there are no tweezers. I've never used tweezers for placing drills. Um, so I don't know if they work better for squares, and that's why you get them with squares. I don't know. I've never tried it. I think I'd make a hot mess everywhere, all over the place. All right. This is on trademark paper. I don't know why I'm picking up on all these little details today, but I just am. Um, it's one of those days. All right. So what did I get? Here's my sticker. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's got 47 colors. That's a lot of colors. That's lots of colors. It's got two ABs because any number under 150 is AB. Let's show you the symbols first. <laughs> Let's just show you the symbols first. It's easier to show you the symbols on here than on the canvas. So 134 is an AB. That's going to be a green, it looks like. 141 is white. Do you see? Yeah, okay. There's symbols. X's, R's. Typical symbols you'd get with Diamond Art Club. 47 of them. Number 47 is the microphone. <laughs> That's what I call it. An hourglass. I call 39 a ladybug. I don't know if anybody else does, but that's a ladybug. There we go. And the hazard. 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 Warning. What did I get? It's called Catching Dreams. I love that name. Catching Dreams. It's a 71 by 56, which is 28 by 22 in inches. Yeah. Round with ABs. Let's look at the picture first. Because these, this is a sticker. And I cut off the little labels. I cut them out and I put them on my containers, label my containers. Um, I don't do anything with the sticker except keep it. I just keep it with the projects. So I know what, what I'm working on, what that kit's about. But this is what it is, you guys. Okay, let's look at it close. We got a glare. There. Flowers down in the corner. There's motorcycles. There's a couple motorcycles, a little cottage. Look at the boats. There's tons of boats. It's another water boating landscape. All these houses up here. All right. 
I like to refer to this when I actually look at the canvas because you know the canvas doesn't always show all of these things until you put drills on. They'll show up, but you just have to wait till you put the drills on. You can't really see them on the canvas. There's more houses back in here and birds. Those are seagulls, I believe. Yeah, they're seagulls. There's a seagull here flying, some over here waiting for a snack. We got some wine or something on a cart. There's a seagull back here even sitting up on top of the wine. Yeah, it's gorgeous. Very, very autumny, rich fall colors in this one. Not saying it's fall, but it's just the look. I mean, the sun's setting. It's just giving everything this golden, golden hue. Oh. So as you know, I am a Chuck Pinson lover. This is Chuck Pinson, and I'm a Chuck Pinson lover. Um, I have all of them except for two, and I'm so excited. I actually connected with somebody that is going to help me complete my collection. They have one, and they're going to they're going to sell it to me, and I'm like, all right, cool. Um, then the only one I'll be missing at that point is that town hall thing from Christmas, which I don't know if I'll ever get that. If you have a town hall from the Christmas edition of Chuck Pinson and you don't want it, get with me. Like seriously, get with me. Then I'd have them all. Here's your directions, your instructions, tips and tricks and your little pamphlet. All right. I'm going to roll this backwards real quick. They're canvas. I don't talk about their canvas most of the time anymore because now I'm just kind of, it's just, it's just not a thing anymore, but it is a thing. You know what I mean? <laughs> the first canvas I wrote, I was like, oh, this is what they're talking about when they say it's soft. It is soft. It's very soft. It's um, a fabric -y feel. It's soft on the back. Um, and I don't talk about that much anymore because I guess I just assume everybody already knows that. But it's very soft. Um, you, don't, you don't realize what it feels like until you actually have one in your hands and you touch it. Um, it has this um, surged edge to keep it from fraying. It's got sparkle in the canvas, which I haven't talked about that in a while. Let's see if I can get it to sparkle. There is a little sparkle. So it has sparkle in the canvas, okay? <clears throat> if you like confetti, you like Chuck, right? I mean, I think every Chuck Pinson is confetti. Like, let me show you what I mean. Confetti is when you only get a couple of drills of a color. So if you look here, you see arrows going one way. You get the little arrow going the other way. Now, you can multi-place some of those lines, okay? Over here, we got a couple ones. Oh, look at those are ABs. Got a couple triangles, a few S's. Not much room to multi-place. Down here, you get a couple lines, but then, you know, it's confetti that's confetti with a little bit of multi-placing. There might have to be sparklers in that light right there. What do you think? Mm -hmm. Perfect place for some sparklers where that light's shining, right? Look at that drill field. Super clear. See what I mean about the confetti? Here's a, here's a line of fours, but then there's ladybugs and yeah. So there is definitely room where you could use a three or four placer and do some lines, but you're not going to get great big blocks of color anywhere. Okay. If we come up here to the top, we might get, well, see, that's still not even a big block. See what I mean? So it's confetti that's mixed with lines down here. Forget it. Down here, forget it. This is, this is confetti. That's real true confetti down here. It's just a couple of each color. But that's what makes these pictures fantastic. Okay, there's one light, sparklers. Here's another light sparklers, right? Yeah. I don't know. Any place where there might be some light. All right. Oh my goodness. You guys. I just, oh my gosh. You know, it's gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous on the canvas alone. And when you put the drills on that, it just, I mean, 
everything just pops right off that page and comes to life. It's gorgeous. Every Chuck Pinson, it's just, they're so beautiful. So beautiful. But you see what I mean? Things don't, on this one especially, because there's so much confetti and so many little details, like all the little birds and stuff. I mean, you can kind of tell down here in this corner there's some birds. I think these are both birds, but you can't really, really see them until you put the drills on. Now these birds up here in the sky you can see. There's three birds up in the sky. They look like ducks here. They got some green looking on their wings, but I'm pretty, I'm certain that they're seagulls, but um, yeah. So all these little details, there's a lighthouse in the back. Sparklers, right? <laughs> um, all those little details aren't going to really pop out until you actually put the drills on because these are not the drill colors. These are just background. So it does show the picture pretty good, but some of the symbols don't really show the true color of the drill. So you're going to get, you know, a lot more definition when you add drills. It's just beautiful. It's just gorgeous. I'm looking at this and see like right here, right here is a, a wagon. Now, when you look at it here, you can't really tell there's a wagon there. The wagon doesn't really stand out. Here's the wheel of the wagon. So that's the wheel. So the wagon's in here. You can kind of tell that these are the barrels, but they don't really look like barrels right now until you put the drills on. But you can definitely tell there's a boat. You can tell there's another boat here. You can clearly tell there's a sailboat back there, and there's a mast, I believe, right there of a boat. Yeah, that's another mast of a boat there. And you can tell there's trees, but you know, it's really, it's really a picture that's gonna really, really become beautiful and details pop out once you put those drills on. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Chuck? You know, Chuck, I wonder how long their contract is with Chuck. I <laughs> wonder how many, how many paintings they're planning on. The sky, you get some color blocking. But that sky's many, many colors. It's just gorgeous. You get your key over here on the bottom, all 47 colors. And you get your key over here with the picture of the painting over here. Oh, it's just, it's fantastic. It's tacky. This is not like super, super stick to glue. It's just sticky enough for your drills. Okay. It's not like I can pick this whole canvas up by the glue, but it's sticky enough for these drills for sure. All right. Oh, what a way to start your morning, right? <laughs> Like I said, these colors are very earthy, rich, autumn-y looking colors. When you look at the whole palette like this, lots of browns, oranges, creams, greens. And then there's a few brighter colors, like this yellow is a brighter pop, and I can see like a pink and a purple that are brighter colors. But they're pretty much an earth tone kind of palette, all of these. Do you want to see them? I'll show them to you. I love how they wrap. Look. Just unfurl them. <laughs> All right. Let's look for a big fat strip. We'll go for a big fat strip first. All right. Like I said, it's lots of browns and oranges. Browns. All different shades of browns, right? Look at all the brown. <laughs> I hope you like brown. <laughs> if you do this painting, you gotta like brown. And orangey, okay? Browns and oranges, ladies and gentlemen. Okay? See? Peachy. Here's our 310s. Not a whole lot of 310s. 
It's got brown in its place. <laughs> now here's a brighter color. Here's a bright yellow. Uh, sun, boats, things like that. We're going to need some brighter colors. We got some purple. I don't know where the purple will go, but flowers. There's flowers. Brown. Ooh, that's 550 purple. That's my favorite purple. Making an appearance. Hello. And then we get some grays. Yellowy orange. And of course, we're going to get a lot of greens too because there's a lot of greenery. Brown. Green. And then some creamy colors going to, I don't know what that is. All right. Haven't found any ABs yet. So they must be in here. Cream. All right. There's our first AB. It is green. 134 green. Okay, AB means it has a coating on the top of it, makes it iridescent, makes it shine and sparkle and all that. Yeah, there we go. There's one. Okay. Oh, and here's the other one, almost next door. The 141 is white. So there's not a ton of ABs in this one. I might see what I can find at Tina Bernie in her shop and see if I can add a few more ABs. Because there's a little bit of white and there's a little bit of that green, but... I mean, I know she's got some beautiful yellows and maybe oranges. I don't know. Let's see. Could use a couple more ABs. Yeah. We might amp it up. I'm still seeing sparklers in the lamps and the light posts. Rusts and reds and a few blues at the end. There's our colors, you guys. Is it just not fabulous? Just fabulous? So you got to be ready to... I open up a huge section. I'll do a video on that sometime. I open up a huge section and I just pick. I just pick them out. It looks really funny for a while because you don't make a whole lot of progress filling in the picture, but I just open up a big section and just pick away at them. Just pick away. It's gorgeous. You guys, just gorgeous. Like I said, sometimes what you see on camera is it can't compare to what you see when you get your hands on it and see it in person. They're beautiful. Beautiful. All right. Um, I'm working on a diamond art club right now for the Hannah Lynn diamond paint along. And when I'm done with that, it's going to be Chuck Pinson time. And I'm going to need some help. <laughs> I'm going to need some help. I'll let you know what I need when I get there. So probably end of February. Yeah, I'm going to be asking for your help. <laughs> but there's another Chuck Pinson. Absolutely gorgeous. Thank you, Diamond Art Club. Man, I don't know how many you got coming down the pike, but whew, I can, I'm about to wallpaper my house, okay? Yeah, I just got to do them. That's all. All right, you guys. Um, did I forget anything? I don't think so. I can't think of anything I forgot. Sometimes I'm forgetting things. But there it is. It's gorgeous. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button, subscribe button if you haven't subscribed. Um, and uh, come back and see the next video. I, it probably won't be another Chuck Pinson for a minute. Or wait, maybe it could be. I have that one coming. Wait. Yeah, just keep coming back. All right. <laughs> I'll see you in the next video.